guys hey guys so before i fall asleep i did say that i was going to do this report shouts out to everybody that hung out with me on i think about a six hour live never meant to be but you know shouts out to kenny ken um uh, lisa bales um everybody aj jed um electro jed shelton coach malachi and the lewis third coast thank you for all joining me especially towards the end as well anyway let me just tell you about old tyson fury and his star power one second stand by so now it's your turn what does that mean to you to have your opportunity here at wembley back home in the uk after as frank says four years yeah, it's been an um, absolutely roller coaster of a ride. I've been a, across the Atlantic Ocean um, in the exotic venues of MGM Grand T Mobile, Staples Centre. Um, and I just feel like the song of Thin Fury Roadshow. And like I said when I was fighting Klitschko, there's only been one man on these shores ever. And he goes by the name of Tyson Fury. And this. Stand by. Of the kind of media stuff leading up to April 23rd. Do you think I need him? Did you see? Did you see what happened today? I'm a one-man army. I'm a one-man band show. It's like I don't need. I don't need an opponent to talk. What are they going to say? Three words and then pass the question on. I, I held this today on my own, single-handedly. I even had an invisible face-off. I don't need anybody to sell a fight. People know what they get when I come to the ring, entertained, or someone gets knocked out. That's it. That's all we do. Despite being in that number one position with the WBC. Apart from all those boxing matches that I did back in the day. I used to outpoint everybody. Bang, 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 and now I just go, bang, bang, bang. See you in a bit more. Shh. Well, you know, he's such a big superstar, isn't he? Massive over here, Tyson Fury. Massive in the US. But then, shouts out to um, Suwaba. Suwab. That's it. Sorry. Suab, so many names. Suab boxing was in the bill, dizzing. He came through on my show today and he showed me this. He'd bumped into this superstar Tyson Fury the first time round. Like, you know, Tyson Fury was just like, yeah, 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 and waved him off. So Suab was like, all right, I'm going to get my camera out. And then we saw this, you know, the superstar. Stand by. Tyson, where is Dillian? Where is Dillian White? Are you going to see him? He's hiding from you. What are you predicting? Knockout. I want to pay. Hopefully. Mind you back there, mate. Swap boxing was in the bill. Dizzy. Swap. Tyson, where is Dillian? Where is Dillian White? Are you going to see him? He's hiding from you. What are you predicting? Knockout. I want to pay. Hopefully. Mind you back there, mate. See, I could imagine why they now I can see why I didn't really want to put Dillian White on a on a PJ private jet, and um, even though they said they would have, but they didn't. That wasn't up for the option, and you know they um wanted to stick him on a Ryanair plane because you've got your own superstar of boxing coming through from the Houston train station. Oh, okay, whatever. That's why if they treat their act. Queensbury, the budget looks like it's a little low there after that $41 million show-off bid that you've got to have your stars and his, you know, with his dad and that coming through in a rainy day, going through Houston Station. I don't even do it. And who am I? 
Lady Shan. Anyway. As you can see, it's not really much of a superstar. You never saw people running up to him. Imagine if that was Dillian Wright walking out in Euston at 11 o'clock mid, near the much midday <clears throat> in central London. There would have been, there would have been everybody flocking to him. Imagine if that was Anthony Joshua. It would have been a shutdown. Game over, game done, game changed. Um, yeah. Um, I'm just wondering where this big fucking star was. Like you said, he's massive. So maybe as he's claiming America, maybe he's a massive star over there because he keeps saying, you know, he's a big star there. But then I speak to my American friends and they're like, no, he's not. So like, where are you a star? So this leads me to know that Dillian White gave Tyson Fury his biggest payday. He was nobody here in the UK. So is he really going to sell? Are they really going to sell 90,000 tickets in the Wembley Stadium? Wembley? Wembley Stadium? Wembley Arena. My bad. No, I there's someone. So. What's done in the dark must come to light. Um, Shouts out to Suave Boxing. Amazing for the capturing the footage and, you know, going about your day and then you just bump into Tyson. Nobody knows for Fury. And yeah. Anyway, I'm gone. Hey girl, it's Leonie Shamrap. None less. Come box with Shan. Gyan. Gyan. Nobody.